All right, so I want to share with you a little project I'm working on. I've become a big fan of the RTL, uh, the Realtek um, RF dongles. The uh, They're actually a DVB, well, it says right there in the middle, DVB-T plus DAB-FM. Um, they're a uh, an SDR, essentially, or that's what they're being used as. I bought a, quite a few of these already, and so what I've done here is I've taken a Hammond project case, it's an aluminum case that I'm using for uh, RF and EMI um, isolation to trap it all in the box. <laughs> no, I'm trying to keep um, other RFI from uh, getting in, but I'm probably going to have more problems than I uh, than I anticipate. Um, what I've got down here is the Noelec uh, up converter. It's a 25 megahertz IF creator, so it takes frequencies from you know below 24 megahertz where the where this thing rolls off. Um, the uh, R280 or whatever the R820 um, tuner chip, where it rolls off is around 25, 24 megahertz. And so that blue board down there is an up converter. Um, what I've done here is I've brought, and I, I need to make some custom cables, obviously these are a bit long, but um, I've got a USB pass-through on the front here, which is mounted like a like an XLR chassis mount would be. And I've got a power pin or power adapter there. It's a 2.1 mil um, coaxial power adapter. And that comes in and that powers this USB powered hub. And this functions to allow me to have multiple uh, USB sticks. In fact, I could easily add a third one and then just another antenna port if, if I so desired. Maybe if I wanted one for, I don't know, six meters or something later. Um, and so what I'm doing here is I've got this, uh, this USB hub suspended from the lid of this thing. I've just put some, uh, used some standoffs to pinch it. And that all comes together here. This uh, cable going to the Noelec, that's simply power. And that one I'm going to change out later with a, with a custom made shorter cable. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Uh, power, of course, going into, into this thing. Um, it can be powered from USB, or if you're using it on like a laptop or something and you don't want it draining your battery like crazy, then you can power it from the uh, external uh, power adapter there. So I'm going to give this a, a quick try and I'll upload a second video of me uh, of me using it and we'll swing around the band, see what we've got as far as EMI or, or noise um, and hopefully it's decent. Um, what I'm going to show you is on this side I've got two RF adapters. So this one here um, is going to be for 2 meters, 70 centimeters, FM broadcast band, etc. Um, even, uh, even if I wanted to do uh, 10 meters or something like that. The one below here, this is a, an SMA connector that's directly connected to the Noelec up converter, and that just terminates here on this SO239 connector. So that is uh, that's what I'm going to use for HF, and this is going to be for uh, for 30 megs and uh, and above. So I'm going to button it all up, and you'll see me in the next video.